In Rayan, you can also add keywords for inclusion and exclusion. Let me explain what that means. So before we imported the reviews, there were actually some um, preloaded keywords for inclusion and exclusion. This does not mean that you are going to exclude based on that. It's just going to help you visually determine which abstracts are going to be included or excluded just by looking at it. So for all the keywords with inclusion or the keywords for inclusion, they are highlighted in blue and the keywords for exclusion are highlighted in red. So if you see systematic review, it says 11 papers have these keywords in it. So when I open the abstract, when I click on anything, when I click on these ones, you can see that it's highlighted. It doesn't mean that they've already been excluded. It's only telling you that this paper has this keyword in it. So maybe it will, it will sort of help you visually determine or prime your mind to include or exclude a paper. So if you want papers, if you don't want papers that have meta-analysis in them, then when you click on it, these are the papers. There are five of them. You can then review. Some papers also contain this review. So maybe you don't, you want to exclude, exclude all reviews. So all papers that have the sentence, this review in it, you can exclude it. If you don't like any of these keywords, you can delete them. So if, for example, you intend to include systematic reviews, then you delete this. So these two tabs are basically about a visual pointer to the fact that this paper is likely to be excluded because it has the word review in it and systematic review. If you want to add your own keywords, for example, with the keywords you search for, you want to add keywords that will help you determine which papers are more likely to be included or excluded, then you can add them yourself and delete the ones you don't like. So if I don't like these ones that Ryan gave me, I'll delete them here and I can add my own. So if I, I want papers that have model in it, if I click on it, it says, oh, there are 55 out of the 140, 140 unique articles that have the word model in it and modeling. If I add that to, you see that there are 16 papers. It's likely that there's an intersection here. For the exclusion keywords, you can also delete this, them in the same way and you can add your own exclusion keywords. So for example, I don't want to include any paper from the United States and this is not because I have any problem with the United States. It's just an example. So if you, there are four papers with the word United States in them. So when I click on them, these are the ones it says here, United States dollars. So that shows you that it's only stating the dollar. It's not saying the study was conducted in the United States. So you want to actually read the paper and determine that. You know the highlighting I was talking about. You can actually turn it off by clicking on highlights off. When you click it off, this these two panels don't work anymore because nothing is highlighted here. And that's particularly important if you want you don't want to bias your opinion.